What are we doing, boys? Um, uh, cleaning our caribou up. Yeah. Then we'll be cutting the caribou. Yep. You reckon it's gonna taste good? Yeah. We might cook some steaks tonight. We'll see. Making good time. That's all right. It's okay to leave meat on these bones. They're going to be soup bones. So just be careful. Don't cut yourselves and just learn about cutting the meat off the bone. You watched me do all the other ones. What you boys doing? Shoveling off the trailer so we can put the machines on. And what are we gonna go do? Yeah, what? And trapping? Yeah, we're gonna go try to go trapping. Try. Never freaking ready. Never. You'd think I'd learn. I knew you could do it. Whose door is open? Wait, did you get that big permit out of the tundra window? Ah, no. I gotta go. Why don't you go get it? Okay. Whose door is open? The other one. Oh. That's the door that was open. He's got to go get that mitt from the tundra. They've been sitting in the truck where it's nice and warm. Truck thermometer says it's 21 below. We're all tied down, ready to go. I need a bigger damn trailer. Did you have fun, Lee? How about you? Did you have fun? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Everybody had fun? You got the icicles on your coat. You boys excited for when we're gonna go check them? <laughs> yeah. You guys gonna come? Yes. Yay. It's a rough day. Can we go um, ice fishing somewhere? We're gonna go ice fishing, don't you worry. left their crap in a pile. I told them to hang it up and they said they did. Forgot to siphon these out. I got shit to do. I'm not gonna stand around and wait for him to, to siphon. <laughs> I'm building some shelves to hang up there. Laid out all four of the long pieces at once. Nailing them together. Let's see what the hell happens. Huh? Hopefully, hopefully this crap don't fall on my head. If I die in my shop, it will be because I was using a ladder on something with wheels. So there's Z blocks. Holding that up there. Sink her in. And then tomorrow I should be able to hang the shelves. Can't shake it out. I might be able to push it out. But uh, up until now I've just been able to shake and go back and forth and get her out i might have to get the shovel here we are just me and the oldest second born flaked out it's a little bit warmer today what do you reckon it is uh, 10 
It's about 10 degrees. We're gonna go check our snares. What's over there, boy? A lynx. Holy shit. Woo! Did you think we were gonna get one? Yeah. You did? Shit, I didn't. <laughs> Hot dang. Tried to get out at all? Oh yeah, of course it tried to get out. Mm -hmm. Hot dang. Wait. Oh. oh look, look, look. What? He got into our, our snare business and we got him on his way out. We got a bait in here with a bunch of snares around it. And here's his tracks. He got, he got into our bait somehow. Somehow, like, like I'm the greatest snareman. And he got into our, our circle and on his way out, we got him. Looks like that, that there could be a rabbit trail, but. Well, maybe. Look to me like it's all his tracks. Oh, man. Is that a big one? Well, it looks like a good sized one. The important thing is it ain't ate up. We've seen them. We've had lynx get cannibalized. All right, here we go. And we were even able to reuse that snare. What's the matter? Is it heavy? Yes. <laughs> Should have started with it higher. Go ice fishing because it warmed up. Been plowing three days in a row now. Ran her dry today. At least I hope that's why it stopped. It'd be nice and easy if that was why it stopped. <sighs> Probably do more plowing tomorrow. I'm asking a Honda to do a skid steers job. The phone doesn't do it justice, especially in the dark. I had to shovel out several times today. Neighbor gave me a yank out of the spot yesterday. I'm about ready to move to Florida. <laughs> 